don't you show my house on your door? I said, get your neighbors to be mad too. So Rhonda talked to all the neighbors. Rhonda came back, she said, Jerry, my neighbors don't mind. Rhonda's his wife. But I think the neighbors have changed their minds. They did not know that so many buses might be driving their community. His address is 9629 Booper Court. 9629 Booper Court. Right now, check out the Downey. Now this star has got a farm 11 miles south left to hang out on. He was at the farm, injured his back. Had to cancel all the shows for two weeks. Got a new song out this time. Top of the charts. You're gonna miss this. There was a big party to start to some of this new song. Now he has a black pick of the drives. He's on the way back to Nashville from St. Clairsville, Ohio. Did a show there last night. I'm hoping to catch him at home this afternoon. Just finished back on a new movie to be out in September. In this movie, he plays role of a ghost. And with his deep voice, he like a great ghost. Now look at your right. It's going to be the last house on your right at the end of the cul-de-sac. The house that has the bunting for the front door. 9629 Booker Court. And let's see what we're going to find yourself in. The truck is here, but I don't see Ronald's Escalade. He's not back yet. Here in front of the bus, the house with the bunting above the front door. A black truck in the driveway, he drives it. On my right is the house of Trace Atkins from St. Louisiana. Trace, big tall guy, 6'6", six, six, runs a ponytail. Trace had a lot of hits. Thinking man, keep on trying, chrome, hot mama, rough and ready, all the lights are on. Now Trace has turned 47. He and Ron have three doors. Mackenzie is now nine. Brianna is six. Trey Lee's is three and a half. Now Trace does have two doors in his first marriage. Both of those girls grew up in Louisiana with his parents. Both were in college. One just had his first grandchild, a little girl, named by Hadley. So Trace had a five dad of five girls, grandpa one girl. Now Brianna, his six-year-old, has a food allergy. They have to be very protective, Brianna. Certain foods can cause her death, particularly peanut butter. Trace has got Congress to pass legislation to make more people aware of food allergies young people. Now Trace is airing commercials on TV this time, trying to make more people aware of food allergies in young children. Brianna had an episode a month ago, had to rush to St. Jude's Hospital in Memphis. She was at school. There was peanut butter somehow the day before it got on the table. The table was clean, but there was still residue of the peanut butter. She came in contact with an office died. She didn't have to eat the food, but just come in contact with it. So very protective Brianna. Now Rhonda, his wife, is from Chicago. Rhonda came and Nash got a job at Arista Records. Rhonda was a publicist for Alan Jackson. But then she met Trace, they started dating, and now she promotes Trace's career. Now Trace and Al will team up October the 2nd. They'll tour together through November 22nd. They're going to do 17 concerts together. So watch for that concert when it comes to the scene. They're not going to perform in Nashville. But they're doing 17 concerts starting October the 2nd. October the 2nd. Trey Seconds and Alan Jackson together in concert. And folks, that's going to be a great concert. Ron and I were talking. Ron and I said, Jerry.